What's going on guys? Brian here and I've got a game of Modern Warfare 3 for you. This is Domination on Interchange. Uh, I believe I'm rocking out the Type 95 with the red dot sight and I really didn't pay attention there where my perks just weren't show up on the screen. Hopefully you guys saw it. I don't really remember. This game is from, I want to say November 8th, a couple weeks ago. And I know, I know, I still haven't been online to play Modern Warfare 3 with you guys recently. Honestly, Skyrim has just got its claws into me. Every single time I turn on my Xbox at night to get ready to play for an hour, hour and a half, two hours, I want to play Skyrim. You know, I'm always looking forward to clearing that next dungeon, going up another level, you know, increasing my skill set, whatever the case may be. It's just got me. It, it won't let go. Any of you guys that have the game, I'm sure you feel the same way. So I did read some of the comments in my last video where I mentioned my addiction. And like I said, I'm, I'm going to make some time uh, because honestly, you know, tomorrow is Thanksgiving Day. And I am off from work today, and obviously tomorrow being the holiday. And I'm taking two half days on Friday and Saturday. So I should be home probably by noon each day. And my wife just left this afternoon, probably about uh, two and a half hours ago, to head down to her parents' house to, uh, in Virginia for Thanksgiving with her sister and my niece and nephew and whatnot. And they go see the whole family down there as they do every Thanksgiving. It's honestly, it's been a few years since I've been down there due to my work schedule. Uh, you know, since even though I am the manager where I work, I try to be as fair as possible with my coworkers. And you know, when they request you know time off around the holiday to spend with their families, I you know I gotta give it to them. I can't take every holiday off for myself. So normally my sacrifice the last three years has been uh, not being able to go down to Virginia like I did the first several years my wife and I were together. Because we've been married now four years, and we've been together ten years. So I was down there for a good, you know, six, seven years straight before, you know, I started my job a couple years back, and I haven't been able to be down there since. But I am going to make every effort to get down there next Thanksgiving because I have been pretty fair at my coworkers, and next year I'm taking it for myself. And with that being said, uh, you should see me online more. I'm going to try to do some live streams in the evening. Uh, since it is just me and the dog, I do have to pay some attention to him as well while, while my wife is away. You know, as normally she's the one that takes him for a walk in the evenings and plays with him a lot more than I do. Because he is such a mama's boy. Now it's on me. It's just me and puppy time. So, it's boys nights in the house for the next few days. Uh, but like I said, I am going to try to make time to play with you guys and do some live streams and some open lobbies. So be on the lookout for announcements from me. You know, hopefully you'll have some notice. Maybe it'll be short notice. I really don't know. You know, it depends upon how you know each day goes, because I do have a lot of Christmas decorating to get done as well. Normally, the you know last few years around Thanksgiving, when my wife has been away, is when I get started on most of my Christmas decorations. Last year, I posted a couple quick videos uh, of my decorations and my process I go through in doing it, and I actually just went out and bought a Sony Bloggy, you know, handheld camcorder. So I may do an updated Christmas video for you guys. They're probably going to look pretty similar to last year's, but I know most of you guys probably didn't see them because my subscriber count has grown a lot in the last year. So I may just do some new, uh, some new ones this year. Hopefully the quality of the video is a little bit better because I did use a pretty old video camera last time around. And also, I am going to be working on uh, maybe a brief Skyrim video or two. Just to show you guys my class, uh, you know, what some of my skills are, what some of the weapons and armor is I'm using. And just get, go over a brief rundown about that. Uh, so maybe we can discuss, you know, some differences in how we have set up our characters for those of you guys that have it. Also, I did want to talk to you guys about one other thing that runs through my head every single year. And that is, it really feels like Christmas is coming earlier and earlier each year. You know, the retailers and the stores and the media and everyone else is just pushing it down our throat earlier and earlier every year. I remember when I went to a couple of quick stores around Halloween, probably a week before, they already had all their Halloween stuff on like a clearance rack and already had Christmas trees, decorations and all the ornaments and outdoor stuff on the shelves. And some of the TV stations uh, like USA, and HBO, I mean, HBO is already showing Christmas movies. I think they started two weeks ago. I was watching the end of Christmas with the Cranks. And now they have four Christmases on already. USA has already done two weekends in a row, showing Elf two and three times, maybe more over the weekend. And actually, I saw last weekend, too. They already had the Grinch on. I mean, come on, man. 
I mean, you can at least wait till after Thanksgiving before you start shoving the Christmas movies and TV shows and specials down our throat. I mean, give us time to enjoy it. I mean, there's a radio station here in the Philadelphia area, B101, that I think it was maybe a week, week and a half ago, they already started playing Christmas music 24-7. I think there's two radio stations locally that do that. I mean, I, I can't even begin to listen to Christmas music till after Thanksgiving. I mean, I don't know if you guys feel the same way about that, that, you know, it's getting pushed on us earlier and earlier. Like I said, I know I start my Christmas decorating this weekend, but that's simply because it's convenient for me because I'm normally off or I have a shortened schedule while my wife is away. So, it, you know, it you know, makes it easy for me to get a lot of that stuff done. You know, I normally get the outside done in the day and I start my Christmas villages in my tree, you know, and try to get all that done or as much of it as I can. And this year, I really got to put the, you know, my nose to the grindstone with the decorating because we're going to be going on vacation in a couple of weeks. We're going to be going to Disney World. So that's one of the main reasons I bought that Sony Bloggy because I, I really wanted to always see, you know, Disney World around Christmas. My father is a vacation club member. So I've been down to Disney several times in my life. Uh, I think this will be my wife and I's third time going down with my father and my stepmother. So I'm going to try to do some videos for you guys while I'm down there. Just so any of you guys haven't seen Disney World, maybe I'll do some you know daytime videos and I'll do some evening videos with all the lights on. Because from what I've seen and heard, they have some really cool decorations down there. You know, hundreds of incredibly tall Christmas trees. You know, a light show in MGM Studios that is over a million lights. So I'm going to do something like that. Like I said, I bought the bloggy for that purpose. Thankfully, Best Buy had it on sale for like one twenty nine, So it was like $70 off. So I went ahead. The wife gave me the green light to go ahead and buy it. So I'll test that out maybe, or like I said, with some of my Christmas decoration uh, videos. So I'm going to try to bring you guys. Like I said, they may be pretty similar to last year's, but like I said, I know most of you haven't seen them. So rather than have you guys go back and watch last year's, uh, I'm going to try to do some new ones. Unless it absolutely doesn't work out, then maybe I'll just link you to the ones I did last year. Because they are probably going to be pretty similar. So, like I said, that's pretty much what I have for you guys today. Like I said, be on the lookout for me online uh, over the next few nights or even during the day sometime. I know Skyrim's going to pull me back in a little bit here and there. But I am going to try to get back online for you over this holiday weekend and play some with you and do some open, lo open lobbies and live streams. And that's in between my Christmas decorating and playing with the dog and whatnot. So, hopefully everything goes according to the way I have it planned out. It always seems like whenever I have a day to myself, whether I take a day off during the week while the wife is at work, or she goes away on a business trip, which doesn't happen often, or a weekend like Thanksgiving, but I'm home myself with the dog. It doesn't quite work out exactly the way I have it planned in my head, but like I so said, hopefully it works out this time. Like I said, we'll see. Like I said, hopefully I'll have a lot of time to play with you guys and uh, catch up. I had a pretty good game there as well. I went 31-9, and, and as always, I hope you really did enjoy the video. I will talk to you soon, and I hope you have a good one.